Hey guys, it's the next day and right now we are here exploring the 100 islands here in Pangasinan and right now we are here in Pilgrimage Island which is a really holy island right here behind me is the 10 commandments but I'll show you guys boom 10 commandments over here and then here up here it's a statue of the holy family see Jesus Mary and Joseph boom so you can tell this is a really holy island and when you reach the top of this island there's going to be a giant statue of Jesus but to get there you have to walk 200 steps yeah. time to catch up to Atijas and Sabi ah, they went ahead so far ahead so here um, you can also do stations of the cross and the stations of the cross is really um, different I just knew this now each station has a statue representation so first station of the cross is the last supper right so sorry so behind me right now is a statue of the last supper here i'll show you so each station each station looks like that uh, statue representation per station which is awesome so so that's awesome we're head, so we're going to go around and we might do the stations across right now because come on it's holy week we have to do something holy so yep It's night time right now. Ha! I'll actually tell you guys more about this resort right now. So, um, this is actually a really nice resort. It's not ha that hard to go to because like there are no rocky roads at all. It's all smooth. It's a really scenic route so you won't get bored. And it's, you know, it's a really fun trip uh, going here. And when you get here, Mismo, it's going to be a really fun experience as well. This resort has um, a full-size basketball court, has two pools, one with a fountain, one without, and one has a 
water slide. Um, they also have a, they have two billiard tables, two dart boards. What else? They have two karaoke rooms. And um, sorry for the bad lighting, Napala. It's uh, it's dark outside. And my only source of light is like this lamp. This is my only source of light right now. Two pools, uh, play area. Their rooms are cold. They're air conned. They have uh, they have TV signal, but you won't watch TV here because there are a lot more things you're gonna do, like what we did a while ago, 100, uh, 100 Islands, which is really cheap. At the Jazz, how much were the 100 Islands? Kanina? Yeah, like for a full trip, like a full trip for six people, that's a good, that's like 6,500. Like one whole day already and uh, you're going to be able to do snorkeling, zip line, what else? Um, awesome views, a good, a good hike. Yeah, and you're able to see a lot of, I don't know, islands, a lot of things that you don't normally see. And another activity you can do when you're here in Bole now is like what we're going to do tomorrow. Um, like we're going to do waterfalls and we're going to do a beach, another beach, like a white sand beach. So that's going to be awesome. Uh, I'm stay tuned for that tomorrow. So yep, that's pretty much everything I want to say about this resort. Really nice. The food here, um, if you head out, you won't miss it. Like, that's how well placed that this restaurant is. If you head out, you're going to see this restaurant called Giant Taklobo. Taklobo meaning giant clam. So, like, giant taklobo. If you translate that to English, that's giant, giant clam. Kind of redundant, but still a good name. Like, it rolls off the tongue well. Giant taklobo. That's the re restaurant that you'll pass by. It's a really good restaurant yep that's everything that i want to say about this place so stay stay tuned for tomorrow for the activities that we're gonna do and uh that's it thanks for watching the video subscribe comment leave a like all my all my social media links will be down below um and uh yeah see you guys tomorrow peace